Yo, guys, it's OneFire here, back again with another episode of another new game. Today we have a Draconic Theory. As I promised you guys, there will be another game here on Monday. It is this episode might come out on Tuesday, I'm sorry. Things are happening today. I live-streamed. Live-streamed, not live-streamed. Sorry, I probably would have live-streamed, but... Anyways, let's go and get it on with this one. This one is Draconic Theory, Some Legends Never Die. So, I haven't even logged in yet, but I wanted to read some of the stuff here, so it's Welcome Adventures! In times of yore, there lived a magical creature whose magical powers and strengths were legend. Dragon was his name, and he was feared by many. Was he good, or was he evil? Was he noble and wise, or full of wrath and vengeance? Into the world of Dragon and find out. Dragon's Theory is a free online dragon game about breeding, trading, and battling dragons. Learn new skills, choose the battle tactics, and battle monsters in epic showdowns of skill and strategy. Each dragon has a unique set of stats, traits, and genetics, which determine how well they will battle and what they look like. Watch your dragon eggs hatch, your babies grow, and improve the next generation over their parents. Gain territory while battling, and explore new lands. So yeah, that's just the starting of everything. That's basically the beginning of it. Um, so we go ahead and click join. Let's get into this. All right, I'm back, guys, and of course I've logged in. So a uh, <laughs> slight bit of a mess up here, and I didn't actually realize that I had done it until it was too late. Um, when it said clan's name, it basically means your login name. So uh, yeah. When, when I ask about the clan, it's, I, I thought it was going to be like, I don't know, for some other reason, I thought it was going to be like a clan clan. I'm telling you guys, it's extremely late right now. So, if you're looking for me on this site, on Draconis Theory, it's going to be Virtual Masters instead of One Fire. Um, yeah, I think that's going to confuse you guys completely. But, um, yeah, it's Virtual Masters here on this site. I don't know if I can change that somehow. I will definitely look around on that. But this is the first site with the first page that we come to on this site. As I'm seeing here, we already have 25 diamonds, which is crazy. Um, don't know what those are. And then we got uh, about, what is that, 50k? Yeah, there's 50k in gold. I'm sorry, I had to split that up. It's fairly late. I don't know why I'm recording this so late, but I am. But anyways, um, let's see. Uh, you have entered the dragon's lair. Uh, group, uh, groups of dragons gather around you looking eager. You need a, They need a leader. Choose a male and a female to start your clan. Okay, so you guys know me by now. It's gonna be fire. Oh, whoa, hi, how you doing? Um, is there purple? I think we'll make the female purple. Um, yeah, black doesn't look right. Um, yeah, we'll make your red dragon for now. Um, base color modifiers, yes? No. No, no, no. Um, base color modifier would leave that as red. Um, black spots. I do like that. Um, can we make that as red as well? Okay. So I got a sort of flaming dragon there. Um, we're gonna name this guy One Fire. There we go. Submit that. Okay, and the female's gonna be fire as well, but um, we're gonna make her purple. Um, black modifier? Nah. Um, what about a white modifier? No. The blue modifier? Not really. See, if they had it as a lighter blue, it would be nice. Can we do yellow? No. I think we'll leave it. We'll leave it as just purple. We'll do purple, purple. Purple, purple. There we go. What's the cream do? Actually, I like that. Can we take off the purple? Okay, purple taken off, it doesn't work as well. 
I'll leave it just like that. <laughs> there we go. Uh, spots. I'm doing white, I think. Eh, that white's a bit off. Can we make a base color purple? There we go. A bit. Right, there we go. And we're gonna name this one. Um, we're gonna name this one Hope. Oop, no, not he Hope. And in this one, hope. There we go. So we got one fire and we got hope. Okay, so your dragons have been created. You may now begin playing. Um, crisp, clear, and cool. Uh, what well, looks like we got a letter. I think that's that's not a letter. Um, nope, no letter. So, no instructions on how to start the game. You guys know how I freaking love that. We just adore it, right? Let's check out our profile then. So here in our profile, we currently have two dragons in our cave. I did, I checked out the profile, which is, I was trying to see if I could change the name or whatnot, but it doesn't seem there's a way to change the actual clan name. I wish there was a way to just change that, because I messed up. My bad, guys. Oh, reset tutorial. Please, please do. Um, that didn't work. Reset tutorial. So it seems the tutorial is not available for us for some other reason. Let's see. Go to caves. Go to caves. Caves are down here. We'll start by the central cave, I guess. Then we have one fire and we have hope here. Um, they're both H three. That's kind of a uh, different. Move dragons set free. Training. Oh, hold on. You've discovered dragon head pendant. Okay, that's over in the corner. Randomness. Um, breeding move battle. For sale. We got all the different ways to, so we got all the different ways to, uh, to, um, how should we say, organize our dragons. So there's all that going on for us. Um, I guess back, I think this is something that said game guide, right? Game guide. Oh, new page. Alright. I don't see something that says tutorial. Okay, so let's see. We got the game overview, we got the game timetable, your clan, your dragon, variant and mutation tendencies, talent training your dragon, um pool of insight, breeding, nurses, battling, 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 advantages and afflictions, auctions, genetic testing, feeding your dragon, exploring the wilderness. Inventory shops, role play, memory crypt, and premium features. There's a there's a way to cheat this game. That's guys, you don't want to cheat a virtual pet game. That'll be a very, very bad idea. Okay, so there's the monsters that we can defeat basically. Oh, it looks like we have a system of like um Beastkeeper. So there's dungeons in here as well, so that'd be pretty cool. I'm not seeing an actual tutorial, so let's just explore. I mean, we got a bit of time to kill, right? Well, check out the clan. At the home, caves, sparring arena. So that's up next from what we've seen here. Um, train all dragons? Sure. Did that work or no? List of dragons, train level. Okay. Don't know what happened there, but that happened. Um, courting Meadow. Choose a mate. Can we... I don't know if we can do this with these two already, because they, like, literally just got born, but, um... Ah? Uh, wait, my diamond count. Something tells me this is a bit off. Uh, is it going to take away from my diamonds? It does. Ooh. Okay, so you have to use diamonds to breed. That's kind of a different thing. I've never seen that before. So you have, like, breeding tokens in this game. Um, can I see those eggs, please? There was a nursery thing then. Yeah, central nursery. Okay. Um, uh, is there a way to... Oh, that's a very unique egg. Um, 
Manage your dragon. Is there a way to, like, feed or take care? There's the health of the egg. I don't really know how long these take to hatch. That's egg one, so we don't have really have a name for this dragon yet. Maybe we should try and name him. Let's check out the other two ones. We got two and three. I think they're probably gonna be about the same. Oh, he's a bit different. Okay, so the health is still all right. Nothing's changing here. But I probably should have done a bit of research on my dragons before we started breeding them. But my bad on that one, guys. Clan again, let's see. Treasure Keeper, so I'm guessing this is... I see, your Treasure Keeper needs to be paid 1,000 gold for the year. Who will keep track of your clan's income expenses over the rolling five-day range. We have to pay 1,000... Uh, I mean, we got it, so... We'll pay him. Um, name our keeper. Um, her name of Johnny. Why not? Johnny the treasure keeper. I think we named him. Yeah, there we go. You keep track of your clan's income and expenses over the rolling five days. Okay. So, next five days he's going to... Keep track of everything. Yeah, we lost a thousand dollars to you. I don't know why we have to pay for you, but I did. I mean, we had we had plenty of money, so okay. Um, inventory, the inventory to potions, items. There's a couple items in here. Okay. Um, sea eagle feather, complete recovery, and there's a summon dragon traits. Let's see, is there a way I can use that? Okay, unidentified, and actions. Um, dragon head pendant. Okay, it can't be used on any of the dragons yet. You can gift stuff to people. <clears throat> okay, so I don't know how any of this stuff is used. A tutorial would be lovely right about now. Uh, battlegrounds. Day one fires a henchman. Yeah, there we go. Uh, they have to be fed. So in the town, it said somebody's farm. Okay, the farm here. Um, we'll go with a hundred cows. Provides five feedings. Yeah, we'll just go with a hundred cows for now. Pretty sure there's a way to get more gold, so we'll just go with a hundred cows for right now. That does that. Um, how do we visit your food stock? I think we'll just buy a hundred of each. Okay, that didn't work how I planned it. Okay, there we go. Okay, we'll buy a hundred of you. Buy a hundred of each. I mean, why not? We have the money for it. Maybe they wind up breeding in the process? I don't know. I mean, we're getting a hundred of them. They've got to breed off somehow, right? Hopefully they breed off somehow. Um, let's go back to our, so we got plenty of feedings. We got, what, we have, we have a thousand feedings right now, I didn't even realize that. That's kind of hilarious, we have a thousand feedings on the bat right there. Um, is there a way we can feed the dragons that we currently have here? We should need ten feedings a piece? Sheesh, those are some big dragons. Um, town? Clan? Caves? Our central cave? Can we feed these two guys? Bonfire? Is there a feed button? 
Offspring, Managed Dragon. Managed Dragon, maybe? Oh boy, that's a lot. Uh, Dragon's Name, Dragon's Picture, Move, Saddle, Set, Free, Training, Edit, Remark, Use, use Item. We use that. Did that do anything? Okay, it didn't do anything, so um, that didn't work. Genetics tests. Submit. Hey <laughs> guys, I'm just all over the place on this one. Uh, it says his genes have been tested. I, what? It doesn't have any genes or what? Because is there a way to feed the guy? Like, let's go and get you tested as well. I mean, why not? You are tested now. Don't know what that exactly means, but all right. Um. There is. This is fairly confusing. Like, I'm looking. Okay, is there a. Wait, there was something about inventory. I remember that now. Inventory. Items. Actions. Okay, so we can't feed the dragons yet. Let's try the battlegrounds again and see if it gives us a different message this time. Uh, one fires a henchman. We have who purchased already. I don't know. There is a wilderness. Let's check out the wilderness. Uh, forest. We're going to take one fire out. Oh, my. Um, okay. Ford, come across the tracks in the dirt. You may choose to follow them or continue exploring. We're gonna go ahead and track that monster down. Your dragon has found the prey and elk. You may choose to attack the this animal if you win. It'll be added to your food stock. The animal has fifty percent chance of hitting your dragon for the max damage of five pounds. For a clean kill, it and add it to your lot of stock. Okay. Trade your diamonds for extra moves. Um, how many moves do I currently have? Oh, I have, okay, up there. The forest doesn't see anything. Um, that we just, I think we'll just click the middle one. Okay. Track it down. Fortune Dragon lost the trail. Okay. Track it down. Fortune Dragon lost the trail. So there's nothing like uh comes across some village hidden in the forest. Quaint Huts beckons you to see what it is, or you can return to the wilderness. Why not? We'll take a look. We'll probably wind up dying in the process. You see an odd looking house surrounded by muck. There is a light in the window, but you knock on the door or continue investigating the village. We're gonna go ahead and visit the The Dragon Shaman. Alright. How you doing, Dragon Shaman? Um, yeah, we don't want to visit you anymore. We'll go ahead and investigate the village a bit more. Investigate. Investigate. Okay, yeah, we're just going to move on. Uh, come on, Dragon. Find us something. Something interesting. Try it down. Nothing. Um... We're literally turning in a circle now. We're just going to go in a complete circle. 180. Investigate. Visit. Okay, another place. This is Helda's Custom Elixirs. Potion mixing? Options? And customs. Okay, so there is a way to make potions in this as well. We'll figure out where that is probably eventually. Moving on. 
Can we get rid of all the uh, the moves we got here? I think I'm going to probably end it off here, guys. Drag it down. Let's kill it. Still can't kill it. Let me see if Dragon has no skill. Investigate. Another nice little spot. This is the Huntsman's House. So I'm guessing we can buy livestock here. More stuff to eat. More food. Um, your visit is good for an hour? What does that mean? It, what? What? It's good for an hour. Like the prices? Isn't there really any good feeding prices here? There's like nothing good to feed here besides like the pheasant. That's 29. And the bison is 28, but nah. Don't not buy anything from you for right now, buddy. Um, last move, we're gonna go forward. Why not? Nothing left. We're out of moves for today. So, uh, with that, guys, I think I'm gonna go ahead and end off the episode. There's like nothing really here. No, st oh, we got three of these things. So, what are these? Oh, those are the eggs. Okay, so that means eggs. Nice. Finally figured that out. Anyways, guys, my name is Onefire. This has been the virtual pet dimension. I, I think. Yeah, probably. But, um, yeah. <laughs> This has been Draconis Theory. And without further ado, guys, if you liked the video, leave a like on it. Comment down below if I could do something better. Or if you see something I could change. I don't know. This site's a bit off. I don't really see a tutorial anywhere or anything going on. So, yeah. Anyways, I will definitely be talking to you guys later.